Shady Crew. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I DIY this Dollar Tree pumpkin wreath. And I showed this in my last video with my fall haul. So I wanted just to give you guys some ideas. Um, every single Dollar Tree I've been going into has had these in store. So if you guys are looking for it, I'm sure they have it at every single store. First things first, please like, comment, and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up. <laughs> and let's get this video started. Okay, so I don't have a set um, thing I want to do. Like, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to wing it. So, I have so many, like, little things. Like, this fell off something from last year. And um, I have my burlap leaves that I showed in my haul, my fall haul. You guys should have already seen it. If not, go watch. And I have um, just some little leaves. Um... These cattails, so pretty. Um, I have my little burlap ribbon. I have some rope. I have um, some other ribbon, very, very pretty. It has like leaves on it. Um, I have this little scarf I got from Dollar Tree. Everything is from Dollar Tree. I have these bowls, very pretty. And yeah, so we're just gonna wing it. And I hope I give you guys some inspiration because um, I love DIYing and when I watch DIY videos, I definitely get inspiration. So, hope you guys enjoy. <music> Okay, guys, so look, I opened up this ribbon. It is super duper pretty. So I was trying to see like if I can just do it like that. But I'm like, it's not going to work like that. So, guys, I'm just really trying to figure out like this is hard. This is not like a circle reef. Like, usually with my circle reefs, I'm so good at it. But I'm trying to see like, can I wrap this around no i think i'm gonna have to use this for something else what i don't know and then i had this idea of putting the leaves like just gluing them on i have my hot glue gun right here um and just winging it trying to see how it's gonna come out because i didn't know that it was gonna be this hard and i want to show you guys the trials and tribulations with DIYs because they're not always that easy. Oh, that's already looking pretty. So I think that I'm going to do something like that. Yes, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to play with the leaves and see what's next. Like these little 
um, branches in the back. So I like that because you're able to hook it on the reef or hook it on whatever you're gonna put on, put it on, and it gives you like some stability. So as soon as I hook it on, I could just leave it like that and then I'll just put my glue, hot glue on the, uh, I put the hot glue on the stern piece of the reef and then I just press the leaf down. So, so far it's looking very pretty just for the, from them too. So I'm happy that I came up with this. little pumpkin somewhere you see this little pumpkin that's one here I'm gonna put this little pumpkin somewhere and then I'm gonna put these little cherries somewhere I don't know somewhere cute so all you have to do is take it off and it'll be like that so oh yes that's pretty right there guys I'm just literally winging this and hoping that it just comes out pretty I'm really really hoping that it comes out pretty. And if you want your stuff to stick a little better, then I advise you to get Gorilla Glue. But since it's for the video and I'm impatient, especially when it comes to things like this, I want to hurry up and be done because I want to see how it's going to come out. I'm using hot glue. Like, I don't have time. I don't have time. <laughs> no, for real. I don't have time to be... Um, I don't have time to be um looking, waiting for Gorilla Glue to dry. Let me see, can I put this inside? Let's see. Ooh, that's so pretty. So guys, look, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to layer this inside the back. sloppy but I just want you to show you guys like you have to trust the vision right so now what you have to do is just like clean up the edges so right now I'm just cutting up the edges Okay guys, so I finished gluing the insides, okay, so you guys can see. Like I said, don't worry about the sloppiness in the inside. Nobody's not gonna see that. I think I'm gonna just leave it like this, but I do wanna add some rope to the stem. So if I would've known this first, I would've did this first. 
but I didn't know I didn't know exactly what I was gonna do so I recommend you probably tie it first tie it on first so you can have like a little base so you just tie it on and then you could just start wrapping around you know so let's see that's the easy way this is definitely harder than it looks guys especially if you already did your reef already like because i want my stem to be very very pretty very very pretty I love it I love it I love it I love it and like I said when you're doing the back of this reef like whatever the design you do don't even worry about it don't even worry about how the back's looking because you're definitely definitely not gonna be able to see the back at all so I don't think that this needs anything else on it if you guys see I had glued the cherries on there that I had um, from this old stem that I got from Dollar Tree as well. I had this from last year and they still have these in there today. So I just took it off and just glued it on so it looks very, very fall like. Okay guys, so this is the final look and it came out super pretty. And I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope I gave you some inspiration. Like I said, all this stuff is from Dollar Tree. Um, you can copy off mine um, to the T or you can do different um, ideas with different ribbon but with the same concept. It came out so, so pretty. I just kept it nice and I was going to add more stuff like on the other leaves but I'm like no, this is just perfect. Everything from the Dollar Tree and you can definitely... Um, uh, add more stuff if you want to but this is just how mine came out um, here's a close-up super pretty and I'm loving the rope stem and yeah so pretty this is definitely my favorite thing so far that I made this fall as of yet well this is my first thing so <laughs> yes but it came out so pretty. I am so happy. And I hope you guys love it just as much as I do. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know down below if you're going to get one of these um, from Dollar Tree. And also let me know down below if you like how it came out. Bye, Shady Crew.